actually mathematics it starts in a very cute way very beautiful way initial stages there is no any other lesson where you bring this nice nice stone toys and start counting no any other lesson mathematics is the only lesson so we all are like oh my god we all are really small children small kids we all wanted to do something with maths we go and do it but after that it starts in a cute way and then it start escalating and escalating and escalating and comes to a stage where you sit in the class teacher is teaching you be like what the hell are you teaching okay leave me understanding mathematics do you first of all understand what you are teaching that's how it will be that's how it start but 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 okay so the beginning of mathematics is very nice this is the story very nice very nicely they will start the start starts like this now when i was in grade 1 no to my math teacher came she drew a line 1 2 3 maths is very easy i get it and then she told we can add these numbers subtract this number multiply divide this that's why it started this thing but still it was going very smooth in my life mathematics it was going very smooth in my life after that at about grade 4 grade 5 my math teacher came she drew a line this is 1 this is 2 this is 3 just yes, teach i know why are you revising and then she told things is there anything in between them no teacher then we will add something One point one, one point two, one point three, one point four until we one point nine. Go now. Things do you understand? Yes, teacher, I understand. Things you understand is because you are a rational person, and these are rational numbers. One point one, one point two, rational. I felt like something big is coming. Why there is the only rational number? Did you know there is some other kind of numbers called irrational numbers? You can't understand it. Even it doesn't exist in the number line. Irrational number. They are like these irrational people. After a point, they just keep on talking and talking and talking and talking. Irrational numbers. After the decimal point, it just keeps going on and going on and going on. Four point three one two three one two three one two three one two. Irrational numbers. Irrational people in WhatsApp group. There are people who just keep on randomly posting. Good morning, sir. Good afternoon. Good evening, sir. Good morning, sir. Good afternoon. Good evening. Three days. Irrational. But remember, my teacher told me, okay, not all the irrational people are irritating. Not all irrational numbers are also irritating. There are some legends in irrational numbers. Between three point one four and three five one five, there are six legends. Five. After five was introduced, all the straight line became a circle and started rolling on two five r. For normal mathematics. You need to use a normal pencil box. For this kind of mathematics, you need to use a steel dabba. You basically call it a geometrical box. I think in geometrical box, everything which is there inside is physical and real. First part you see is a compass. Compass is a person without a leg holding a pencil going around. <laughs> Next you have set square. Set square, as you know, is a set of squares. No, they are triangles. Basically, handicapped squares are triangles. Next, you have a nice person inside. It's called as a divide. It's up to date. I don't know what's the use of it. Divide. I don't know. But still, maths was easy in my life. I was into it because it was cute. I was into it. I wanted to do it somehow. It went. Came to our grade eight, grade nine. Maths teacher came with a black big box bag. She put the hand inside and she told her things. There are two white balls, five red balls, <laughs> seven yellow balls. Can you tell me what is the ball I am holding? You take the hand out and immediately tell him, sir. No, you need to tell why the hand is inside. Teacher, that is black magic. No, that's probability. After that, I started losing probability. That's the point. But still, I wanted to hold it because I started with a very so. So I wanted to hold. I was trying and trying and trying. Grade nearly about grade nine, grade ten. My teacher came in. She told, "Things here after in mathematics, we are not going to talk about numbers. Instead, we will only talk about x and y." <laughs> after that, these questions solve for x, solve for y. Those types of questions. I really solve those questions like I'm a agent or or I'm a police person who is actually finding x. Hey, X job. Who is hiding there? Four point one two. Come on, X be like this time you found me. Next time you won't find me. And the same way, next question I can't find. 
However, after that, everything in mathematics changed. Numbers totally different. Either it went up, all the numbers changed into x, y, x over y, y over x, x squared, y squared, x squared over y squared, y squared over x squared, dy, dx, dy over dx, dx over dy, d squared over d, y squared, and finally something called integration number. Where <laughs> integration number where question is an equation, answer is a more bigger equation. And the funniest part is name for that operation is called as solve. What kind of solve? I have created a more bigger problem. So remember, in science also there are questions like mathematics, which starts in a very cute way. You come do this. These types of questions, acid base type questions, next lesson questions, I told you, only three questions are there. Delta Q equals MC, Delta Theta, Delta Q equals DVC, Delta Theta, Delta Q equals DV or MC, Theta F minus Theta I. Those three equations are only there. Those types of questions are very easy. But seems hard, not like mathematics. Seems hard, but very easily you can see. Then I'll be sure what? Questions to select. Best questions to select. Right? From there you can go.